This is video of a crime in progress. They broke into the school and there was some damage. A little after 2 o'clock in the morning on Thursday, police in Fayetteville and Brown County say three teenagers and two young adults broke into the Fayetteville Perry Middle School and High School building. This sequence suggests the suspects knew they were being recorded. After opening locker doors, one member of the group grabs an object that may or may not belong to him. This isn't the crime of the century, however, but, you know, the, we can't. We can't stand for this. Before Courtney Worley became an assistant prosecutor in Brown County, she was a student in the Fayetteville Perry School District. It's an honor to be from Fayetteville. Worley is having a hard time understanding why these young people decided to break into her former school building in the middle of the night. We can't have individuals breaking into schools and, you know, whether it's to commit a serious offense or, you know, a lesser offense, it's, it's not something that we can tolerate. Initially, police didn't know who the suspects were, but after posting these images on Facebook, more than 50 tips poured in. Those tips led to charges against all five individuals. I give tremendous props to not only law enforcement, but also the community, because without the community, they would have, it would have been difficult to identify these individuals. What happens next will be up to a judge. This isn't the crime of the century, but, you know, we'll just see how it plays out from here. And I talked to Fayetteville Police Chief Chad Essert today. He says the five suspects are being cooperative and don't have extensive criminal records. At this point, the chief thinks, again, the group got bored and made a bad decision. Todd Dykes, WWT News 5.